Hello guys! Welcome to the new episode of Ale Review, Archive. I'm Architect Oliver and welcome back to my channel. Today I prepared another series of questions for acoustic and illumination, disaster prevention, security and communication system. We are now at episode 2. But before we start guys, if you're new to my channel, kindly subscribe para maging updated ka sa mga videos and questions na ipopost ko. So let's start. Number 1. A unit of illumination equivalent to 1 lumen per square foot. Again, a unit of illumination equivalent to 1 lumen per square foot. A. Luminous flux. B. Luminance. C. Foot candle and D. Lux Answer C. Foot candle Next Which among these places of assembly have the most critical noise requirements? A. Auditoriums B. Theaters C. Concert halls and opera houses and D. House of Worship Answer C. Concert halls and opera houses Next Bending of sound wave when traveling forward changes direction as it passes through different densities Again Bending of sound waves when traveling forward changes direction as it passes through different densities A. Deflection B. Reverberation C. Reflection and D. Refraction Answer D. Refraction Next Condition characterized as vertically downward directly below luminaire Again Condition characterized as vertically downward directly below luminaire A. Point source B. Nadir C. Lumen and D. Lambert Answer B. Nadir Next, luminous intensity of any surface in a given direction per unit of projected area A. Luminous flux B. Luminance C. Foot candle and D. Lux Answer B. Luminance Next Branch of acoustics that involves control of noise pollution, environmental noise, which includes motor vehicle, aircraft noise, etc. A. Architectural acoustic B. Psychological acoustics C. Musical acoustics and D. Environmental Acoustics Answer D. Environmental Acoustics Next Number of cycles per unit time of wave or oscillation expressed in hertz cycle per second A. Structure-borne sound B. Liquid-borne sound C. Solid borne sound and D. Airborne sound. Answer A. Structure borne sound. Next, rustling of leaves in breeze is said to be within the blank. A. Threshold of hearing loss. B. Threshold of inability. C. Threshold of feeling. And D. Threshold of hearing. Answer. D. Threshold of hearing. Next. Material name in honor of German physicist consists of a hollow material with a small hole on one side. This is used to detect individual frequency of complex acoustic wave configuration. A. 
Helmholtz Resonator B. Transodent C. Pyramid and D. Panel Absorber Answer A. Helmholtz Resonator Next Means of producing light from gaseous discharge Again, means of producing lights from gaseous discharge A. Luminance B. Gas discharge C. Fluorescence and D. Phosphorescence Answer C. Fluorescence Next, the rate of flow of sound energy Again, the rate of flow of sound energy A. Sound wave B. Sound intensity C. Sound length Sorry, C. Wavelength and D. Scene wave Answer B. Sound intensity Next, sound system input device that react to and convert variable sound pressure into variable electrical current. A. Tuner B. Speaker C. Amplifier and D. Microphone Answer B. Microphone Next, the apparent shift in frequency occurring when an acoustic source and listener are in motion relative to each other. The frequency increasing when the source and listener approach each other and decreasing when they move apart. A. Doppler effect C. Amplitude C. Frequency and D. Resonance Answer A. Doppler effect Next, what is the single number often used to evaluate partitions? Again, what is the single number often used to evaluate partitions? A. Sound absorption coefficient B. Sound transmission class C. Sound intensity and D. Transmission loss Answer B. Sound transmission class Next, why should high pressure instead of low pressure sodium lamps be used in a storage warehouse? A. They are less expensive B. They have a longer lamp life C. They can operate at higher, more efficient voltages and D. They have better color rendering properties Answer D. They have better color rendering properties Next what method is the first defense from external noise by site selection and site planning for a quiet internal acoustic environment? Again, what method is the first defense from external noise by site selection and site planning for a quiet internal acoustic environment? A. Use of noise insulating building envelope B. Using non-sensitive parts of the building as barriers C. Positioning of opening away from the noise source and D. Avoiding zone of directional sound Answer A. Use of noise insulating building envelope Next, the acronym IES stands for A. Illuminating Engineering Standards B. Illuminating Engineering Society C. Illuminating Efficient Standards and D. Illuminating Efficient Society Answer B. Illuminating Engineering Society Next, 
Surfaces that are best for distributing sound as they provide a widespread of reflected sound. Again, surfaces that are best for distributing sounds as they provide a widespread of reflected sound. A. Flat surfaces B. Concave surfaces C. Convex surfaces and D. Smooth surfaces Answer C. Convex surfaces Next, why telephone wires and electrical wire are not placed together? Again, why telephone wires and electrical wires are not placed together? A. Heat accumulation B. Telephone wire will burn and damage C. Wire management and D. Signal will be interrupted Answer D. Signal will be interrupted Next, why is it necessary to plan the data connection tables? Again, why is it necessary to plan the data connection tables? A. Data cable are expensive B. To avoid visual chaos C. To optimize data transfer speed and D. None of this. Again, why is it necessary to plan the data connection table? Answer. C. To optimize data transfer speed. Next, please see the image. Identify. A. Tungsten halogen lamp. B. Mercury vapor lamp. C. Metal halide lamp. And D, high pressure sodium light. Answer A, tungsten halogen lamp. Next, describe the type of lighting symbol in this image. Again, describe the type of lighting symbol in this image. A, stake mounted adjustable fixture. B, Tree or building mounted adjustable fixture C. Junction box mounted adjustable fixture and D. Wall mounted scones Answer B. Tree or building mounted adjustable fixture Next, describe this image A. Insulator B. Fuse C. Conductor and D. Capacitor Answer D. Capacitor Next, describe this image A. Hi-hat B. Lens HD C. Eyeball and D. Track light Answer C. Eyeball Next, describe this image A. Tungsten halogen lamp B. PAR lamp C. Mercury vapor lamp and D. Metal halide lamps. Answer C. Mercury vapor lamp. Next. What is image A? A sealed room in which all the surfaces are designed to completely absorb all sound produced in the room. Again, a sealed room in which all the surfaces are designed to completely absorb all sound produced in the room a acoustic chamber b dead room c an echoic chamber and d live room answer c an echoic 
chamber. Next, what is the image? A. PABX B. IP Telephony C. KSU and D. LAN Answer A. PABX Next, identify this image A. Stage light B. Floodlight C. Spotlight and D. High intensity light. Answer B. Floodlight. Next, a sound which is discontinuous or fluctuates to such an extent that at times its sound pressure levels fall below a measurable level. A. Intermittent sound. C. B. Masking sound. C. Reverberant sound and D. Scattering sound Answer A. Intermittent sound Next, a system in which each manual fire alarm station and each group of automatic detectors has its own individual code which sound on all alarms indicating devices in the system when the manual station or automatic detectors is actuated a selective coded system b master coded system c non-coded system and d trouble signal answer a selective coded system Okay guys, thank you very much for watching this uh, episode for Acoustic and Illumination, Disaster Prevention, Security and Communication System. I hope you learned something about this uh, video, some information, images. Uh, I, just wish, I just want to wish you guys uh, good luck sa darating na board exam. And thank you. Goodbye.